Hello everyone, привет всем and welcome back to very excited video blog. You have asked me many times in the comments to create a tutorial video on stable diffusion automatic. In the future I will continue making videos about stable diffusion and AI as experiment a lot in this area. But whatever I make more tutorial video depends on the response to this one. You can support my channel and this video financially on YouTube or PayPal or by leaving a comment or liking this video. So let's talk about what we will cover in this video. We will use the iterator extension to get an image prompt. Load the image and choose fast mode when click get. Copy the prompt what appears. Edit the prompt removing anything unrelated to describe the picture. and add the name Scrooge McDuck. Set the image size and cover it to the required size by adjusting the noise range to zero. Send the image to image to image for, for the transformation. Now set the noise range to 1. In control net unit 0 enable Kenny and choose a model. Download the control net models from the Civit AI website and copy them to the specified path. Setting control net size to 0.3. You can experiment with this value trying uh, 0.2 to 0.35, for example. For control net unit 0, set control mode to my prompt is more important. Proceed to set up the control net unit. Enable it and set control net weight to 0.7. I recommended use 0.6 to 
0.75 and leave control net mode at balanced. Optionally, you can add a colorized off to the prompt, but it's not necessary. Now, you can generate an image. If you want to make the image more 3D-like, you can add a prompt for photos. That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Best way to say thank you to the author is to share this video with your friends or support this channel, subscribe, donate and I will hope to see you next time.